Hello. Oops, I'm here. Yep, I'm back. Um, I was going to broadcast a couple of days earlier when the new DLC dungeons dropped. However, as most people have noticed playing this game, you all see how successful that was. There, for a brief moment, we got to play the new dungeons relatively easily. Then, for some reason, they did a quick hotfix update, I don't know what, for the achievements. And now we're where we're at. Instead of running through some of the dungeons and maybe collecting some armor, I'm kind of killing time over here in Cyrodiil, because why not? If this gets to be too boring... Oh god. Oh, the hammer? Okay, I might as well chase the hammer. I didn't realize we had the hammer. Otherwise, I wouldn't waste my time at that area. Good to see the uh, lag with the uh, cut screens there still the same. Odds are I'll be ganked somewhere between here and there, but might as well run. Anyway, with the new achievement updates and me having a played this game since it began certain of my early, newer characters do look kind of funny with everything filled in and I haven't quite figured out what their symbols on the map now mean. I'll have areas now with the white line around the dungeon marker but it black but I know I've been in that dungeon with that character. So I'm not I have to probably go on Look at some YouTube videos or have somebody smarter than me explain it. But that part's messed up. And it is kind of annoying since I'm one of those type who likes to keep track of what my different characters have done. Okay, I wonder what's going on that I was able to wander right through there. Well, let's wait here for a few minutes. They got to have had somebody in there. Okay, finally, people get in there and kill those guys. Obviously, when you've died in a castle like this, and there's an actual chance of your team flipping it, you stay here. Do not disappear uh, off to respawn anywhere else. The reason being is because you will miss out on all of those experience points you will get if you don't stay here. Somebody really needs to take those guys out because they come never any pain in the ass really oh good finally oh cool I managed to somehow complete one of those quest from last time. Okay, he's running with the scroll. Honestly, uh, well, whatever. I'd like to do other things than just play with the scroll, but sure, why not? What scroll is it that you actually have? Chim. What? quest do I have? I have the Elder Scroll of Chim. Well, interesting. I was actually disappointed that I was going to have to stay here stuck in Cyrodiil because literally nothing else was going on because of the group finder problem. But picking up the experience points and all that for one of those scrolls is not bad. It 
it's annoying, but again, valid combat move to hang out there like that and just be annoying picking people off. That's what most troll groups do. see you do I want to sit here and try and save this place I guess so let me help oh. go upstairs and start attacking those guys they seem to be coming a problem because while everyone else is gone they'll try and siege the door yeah, these guys are hanging out here for a while, for a reason. This is pretty annoying because I can't keep track of them, but this is really the only way to slow these guys down. Is hit them with something that will defile their healing. They're still down there. Okay, the catapult is not quite as effective. Well, that did sort of scare them out of areas. Oh, and there they are. That's pretty impressive that I could actually cast that spell that far out. Finally. Those guys are a lot harder take out them one would think and yes it is mind-numbingly annoying to try and take them out like that fool there definitely have to kill him before he helps his friends Well, he's definitely out there. Do we take that or do we kill him or what? Hmm. Okay, I guess I've done all I can do here. Generally don't like hanging around like this, but I wanted to at least get this castle secured or help. And those guys were kind of being a pain in the ass wandering around. I could just easily be ganked here now. Just one or two of them are hanging out. Yeah. Okay, the hammer and the scroll are going this way. They've already... Good thing I slowed down. 
It's always embarrassing to leap off a cliff and kill yourself out here. Okay, if he's running with the Elder Scroll of Chim up north, what possible reason for? Unless you're going to take this and flip it and stick it in there. Well, okay, I don't really care how that works, just as long as you actually take the keep and they drop the scroll into the keep and it does not be a waste of time. We're in the door, that's a good sign. don't get what the hell they're doing here with the scroll here if they don't plan on I bet it was some DC guy taking the damn thing now if we do somehow manage to take this deep that would be pretty awesome Oh, even better. Deposed an emperor. Okay, I guess that was okay. And the keep is ours. Well, see, it's a good reason not to be so judgmental. I hadn't realized they were running up here to take out the emperor. But. Not sure why they thought it necessary to bring a scroll with them. Fun. Let's go upstairs real quick. I don't think there's anybody up here, but at least I'll be able to see what's going on. Ah, gangers. Okay, people wake up. Honestly, don't know what they could be doing with a scroll. You don't usually farm people with a scroll like that. use of the scroll I've seen. Usually people don't go out there and fight with it. They run it to a keep and plop it in the damn keep.
No, oh, let's run downstairs and see what's going on. If this gets to be like too weird or too something, then go leave here and go back to doing some of my normal things. Okay, the keep is still under fire for some reason. It's in here. A red, no less. What the hell is EP doing over here? Everyone's leaving, but they're still up there in the tower. And I think there's two of them actually now. Head out with the scroll, it's not really worth bothering that Nightblade over there who can stealth at will and hits with poison. Nobody else is going to try either. If they retake the fort, so what? <laughs> That's it. Get one of those small smaller wild cats to ride you can jump up things like that For some reason the box is or at least it feels a little bit smaller okay where are we going to now not that I'm going to answer that question we get here In glade mist. Hmm. Okay, blown through that pretty easily. A little bit easier I'm not worried about actually healing anybody else which is straight doing damage with this character. <clears throat> yeah, that's what I'm planning on doing. I think this is just a swing to go take Sizzlebells and not or keeps and not actually care about anything else other position on the map or anything. I 
I guess it's fine by me. The scroll's there. So what are we doing with the scroll? There's somebody fighting in there. Probably get out of there. Couple of DC up there. Now they start attacking. When it was just me, they could have maybe helped a little bit more. Hopefully I got credit for that guy's kill. He wasn't pain in the ass. back to the healing wall now for at least a little while and stay away from those people with their netches. In case you don't know, if you're carrying around a netch who automatically uh, does his purge on you, if you've ever been hit with plague break armor, it will blow up on you. So those people with their netches are basically time bombs waiting to happen. Fortunately, I never got used to using those on any of my wardens. I don't know, I just didn't like having them float around with me for some reason. Okay, since I'm not with the group, oh, the hammer's finally been taken along with the scroll of chip. <sighs> I knew this wasn't a good idea. They should have taken the damn scroll back and planted it somewhere. Oh, well, we'll see what happens here. They're not doing a whole lot of chatter either on the dialogue box. Apparently I'm acquiring experience points, though, from things I've done before. But other than that, the hell are you? Okay, is drop the Elder Scroll, Tim. I don't know why the hell that guy's standing there, other than he's hoping he can drop the scroll there.
have to tell you, this is the weirdest raiding party I've ever been in. Yes, it's highly successful all the way up here, but I have the slightest clue what the hell any of these people are doing. Don't think he made it. Should be fun. Okay, let's see what happens. Hopefully they'll take this. Okay, for some reason, we ran the scroll all the way up just to give it and the hammer to DC. Oh, that was the red scroll that we ran over there. Yeah, nobody's coming to get us here. We're gonna take that. So, let's go back here and acquire our mission board stuff. <laughs> as soon as we get through another loading screen. And here we are. I don't know why they're, they're saying you have four is up here. Why? Why run it up there in the first place? Okay, well, I'm here, so let's go turn in. Oh, 
this one we did? Huh. Thought for sure it was the other one. <clears throat> the, with the bounty kills with the number of people. Oh, we did get three keeps. Okay, at least accomplish that. Happier still to hear of your success. Yeah, me too. Okay, that's not going to pop a new one anytime soon. Take a break. That could be next, or that could be next. Let's see what I have here in Cerdo. Kill sorcerers. Forget about that, actually. That and that are both the, this, no. These two here are the regular quests from these guys. The other one's a town quest. I'll just keep up with this. I'll pop in here and then see what's going on. And now let's see the map. Oh, okay, I guess we'll pop over to Alicia because they're going to attack that. Even if we lose it due to siege. I should still pick up some decent AP points out of that. Doesn't look like the blue want to do much of anything. And this is a perfect time for EP over here to attack us while we're busy screwing around up north. No, they can't already be here, can they? Yep, well, yes, I guess EP is. Oh, it's just some tank troll out there. Forget them. Let's sit and watch them bounce around. Okay, map-wise, this is what my maps are now looking like. And I know some of these areas I've actually seen with this character. Deadlands, however, I haven't done much with. Oh well, let's see what we're here. I guess I'll go see what these people are doing liberating the lumber mill. With everyone else. And again, yeah, nothing else, it's experience points, and maybe we help the war effort. For those of you who also don't know, AD somehow won again, or won this last campaign, which all the other groups are a little bit upset, as you would think. Okay, they're going to ride right back in there. Oh good, at least some people who are somewhat more conscientious of holding on to territory.
Okay, all done. Once it does that, you can pretty much leave. Just stay in the area. And I guess we'll be off to liberate the mine. And I'm sure it's one or two EPs basically running right in front of us to take the resources for the, uh... Oh. Not good. And they're still here. Not bad, actually killed those guys off. Usually people doing that sort of thing are a lot tougher to take out. But and these guys weren't bad, it's just they had a group of people who knew what to do and so just sort of chased them around. Taking out two tanks like that unfortunately does require dropping your ultimates on them to just break them down, basically. All right, I'm Let's see where we're going. They are not going there. They're going in here. Almost kind of grateful they're not heading down the uh, bridge and siege here. Got somebody up there. Row is having stuff taken. Who's this? Not really sure what I want to do here because it isn't all that exciting here either. So, one quick trip to see if there's anything to be done at Row. I don't think there's going to be any sorcerers hanging around waiting for me to collect bounties on them. I've run down here in this situation before and I was like 40 of these guys waiting. This wasn't that bad to run over here, but I imagine the rest of the afternoon, at least for now, will be more or less this. So let us, okay, get our rewards. It will flip soon enough. A little late to the party there. And head back. Must be one person trying to take that if they're still fighting over it after all this time. And here we are. 
I think I'm going to stop on the PvP for a little bit here because it's sort of boring and uninteresting. And it's mainly because of the screw up with the group finder and the dungeons. Nobody can queue for the new dungeons, really. So that's somewhat disappointing, too. I've actually plit run through both dungeons. Say, you're the one who exposed that swindler and Darway, aren't you? <laughs> yeah. Alien warlord, my ass. Anyway, I like the Coral Airy a little bit better than the other one, but both were, like, average. And as for the bosses, they weren't that tough, although I could see in vet mode, a couple of bosses could be really, really tough. Anyway, that's it for me. Um, I'm going to sign off here for the broadcast. And uh, I'll see you next time. I might do more tonight, or depends sort of how the uh, PvP in that goes. Today was just kind of odd feeling how it went. Anyway, thanks for watching.